The following is a presentation of Tuning Into Sci-Fi TV, the viewer's guide to genre television. Welcome to another bonus show for Game of Thrones Season 5, although we're well past Season 5 at this point. I am Wendy Hembrock. I am joined today by a little bit of our small council. Introduce yourselves, please. This is Christine from Michigan, the Mistress of Consistency and Correction. And hi, this is Shaven from Vancouver, Washington. He's the master of the extreme close-up. Exactly. Uh, uh, and I am Wendy, the mistress of video conferencing this week, uh, which we'll talk about in a minute. But uh, we're going to have a very brief show today. I uh, just want to talk about a couple of interesting links we found, mostly fan-created humor stuff, and also share some really exciting news about um, some guests we're going to have. But uh, before we get into that, I want to talk about some links um, First, the digital version of Season 5 is coming out very, very soon. Um, you know, just in time for back to school, basically. It'll be here just in another couple of weeks. And also, there's a couple of really fun mashups of Game of Thrones with other genres. One is Monty Python, and the other is Sesame Street. And of course, advantages to make Sesame Street very rude, but lots of fun. Yeah, you gotta love all the mashups. I say if you check out the Monty Python one, uh, either know your Holy Grail really well or rewatch it first. Yeah, heck, rewatch it. I mean, <laughs> who wouldn't want to rewatch Holy Grail? Uh, the Sesame Street one. It uh, looks like most of the video they got for that was uh, taken from uh, the blooper reel, which I appreciate. I mean, those blooper reels are great. Uh, the season five digital release. Uh, came with some uh, some extras, but it looks like most of the extras have already been released uh, to, you know, view on uh, YouTube or HBO extras, but it did say that two of them would be exclusive to the digital release, so those might be worth looking into. Yeah, that's, uh, that's interesting, the timing on that and that there would be anything, at least at this stage, that would be exclusive to the digital release. I'm one of those people that's kind of old school. If I really love a show... Uh, or a movie, I will always buy it on a physical media just to make sure that I'm not subject to the whims of bandwidth or rights or streaming or whatever. Uh, so I, I always jump on the and pre-order the Blu-rays. And typically they have all the, you know, the gag reels and the histories and lore and all those things and an abundance of special features, which we often talk about here on the podcast and, uh, and are fantastic. So if there is anything that's exclusive to those, I hope it makes its way online because uh, I just... You know, between HBO Go, which I get, and all the episodes I save to my DVR, I can rewatch them at any time. But I prefer to have the good old-fashioned physical media. And those uh, those extra or not extras, those uh, links to the Monty Python stuff, those are pretty funny, and they don't take long to get through. So check them out. Yeah, the um, the DVD or the DVDs, the digital version comes out uh, actually today. We're recording on August thirty first. Uh, so way, way ahead of when the Blu-rays are coming out, which isn't until, like, the end of March. So um, it doesn't sound like there's anything extra special on the digital ones yet. Uh, it does say that there's going to be a trailer, but I can't imagine how much they've actually filmed yet. You know, it's only been, like, a month and a half. But, so maybe it'll just be sort of chopped up stuff or sort of the key art or something. But uh, fun stuff. But let's talk about the actual fun stuff. So uh, if folks are current with their bonus shows, they know we've been talking about uh, the very interesting videos from the Game of Thrones Academy YouTube channel, 
with Gil and Itamar, and our stalking campaign on Twitter was successful, <laughs> and we have convinced them to come on a show and talk with us, and we're actually going to do it as a Google Hangout, so there'll be video of us talking. Uh, we'll probably also rip it as audio and release it as an audio program as well, but uh, that's coming in about two weeks, two and a half weeks, uh, and then it'll be out and released. So in the meantime, if you have any questions that uh, you would like us to discuss when we meet up with our uh, friends who have a lot of historical knowledge about the time period the Game of Thrones is set, send on your feedback. Uh, we also have closed down the poll for a rewatch of season one, and uh, it seems like folks want to listen to us talk about season one. The problem is we need to coordinate our schedules, so uh, we're probably going to do a season one rewatch, but not right away, and it may be compressed <laughs> based on time frame. So uh, TBD, but maybe coming... And I'm not even going to promise if it comes before season six or after <laughs> at this point, given the uncertainty of schedules, but uh, we'll do the best that we can. That sounds like a George R. R. Martin timeline, Wendy. <laughs> Maybe we can make it a Christmas present. <laughs> there you go. It could be an extra special Christmas present. Could be Easter. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, we'll see. So, uh, again, we're really excited about talking with Gil and Itamar, and um, that's when we'll be talking to you all again soon, too. And if you get the video podcast, you'll be able to see some of our faces. <gasps> oh, my God. I need to put on makeup. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, so we didn't discuss whether any of us will be in our Game of Thrones costumes or not, um, but I, I don't think so. Well, I don't have a Game of Thrones costume. I yeah, have neither do other I. Costumes. <laughs> And I am wearing a House Stark T-shirt right now, so. Oh, I do have a, I do have some Game of Thrones T-shirts. I can scarf one of those up. I have uh, medieval garb. Is that count? <laughs> there you go. Uh, stuff I wear to the Renaissance Festival. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Okay, so um, I think that's going to wrap it up for us. But we will be talking to you again soon and seeing you in person too but uh, thanks everyone for listening and participating and we'll see you again soon take care bye everybody we love to get your feedback call us at 206-202-4182 or leave us a skype voicemail to our tuning into sci-fi tv name we have many ways to keep the discussion going on our blog drop by tuning into sci-fi tv.com and leave a comment on the blog, you'll also find links to the forum discussions and other links to follow our Twitter and RSS feeds and find our Facebook account. Listen to Tuning Into Sci-Fi TV on Stitcher Radio On Demand. Download the free app today at stitcher.com. You've been listening to a Game of Thrones special from Tuning Into Sci-Fi TV, episode 54, recorded August 31st, 2015.